All right, ready? Samuel Guilford Riders Hub here with New Leicester Riders signing Mustafa Heron. How does that sound, Mustafa? Oh, pretty good. Yeah. Pretty good. Exciting. How, how, how is it to be in Leicester? Of course, it's been a hectic few days for yourself, getting off the plane and then playing two games. How, how have the past few days been? Uh, the past few days have been uh, pretty good. Uh, mm. Definitely a new experience. It's rookie year. It's my first time playing, um, coming off an injury in about a year and a half. So just kind of just getting acclimated to being back in the game, being back on the floor, just getting up and down. It's been fun. Uh, I've missed the game terribly, missed the game. So. Mm. Came in due to an injury due to Zach, uh, Zach Jackson. Uh, how, how, how fast did the move come about? And, and have you known about the interest for a while, or has it been the past few days when you've kind of it's all happened? Uh, it's been, I want to say a week or two before uh, yeah. before I came out here. Mm. So it was a pretty quick process, um, pretty pretty quick turnaround. But like I said, I was excited to you know even get the call. And as soon as um, I was you know able to hear that everything was you know a possibility, I was I was ready to jump on the opportunity. Going to Auburn and St. John's for college, yeah, kind, of, kind of talk us through your college career to now go turning professional. Yeah, um, well, I start, you know, I started at uh, Auburn University my freshman mm. year. I played two years there. Um, I, we won a conference championship my sophomore year. Mm. It was really good. Uh, you know, had a little tournament run. We lost in the second round. Really good experience. You know, um, just being able to grow with that group of guys. We were predicted to finish last in the conference that year. So uh, for us to be able to win the conference and then go to the tournament, it was just a it was a magical ride, magical run. Mm. And then uh, my junior year, I transferred to St. John's University in New York, finished my college career out there, and then I ended up uh, getting hurt last year. So I played about half the season. Uh, had to get the season into surgery. So now I'm back here and um, just ready to go. Yeah, it must be great to be back on the court then after sure. having an injury like that to sure. turn professional and come over to a great team like the Leicester yes, Riders. Yes, yes. Uh, number one team in the conference. You know, mm. Once Coach Rob you know, called my phone, it was I started doing my research on the team and I was pretty much ready to get on the plane from that day. Of course, it must help as well being from the same hometown as Rob. Yeah, that, that also helps as well, yes. Yeah, how, how, how has it been then in practice for the past few days? Of course, uh, like I say, two games, but then of course, a full week of practice this week going into yeah. Cheshire this weekend. Uh, you know, starting with the, getting off the plane and then um, going right into the games. I mean, it was just, um, I was so excited. That, like I mm. said, it's been a year since I played, so if somebody had told me I could have played basketball on the plane, I would have yeah, played, yeah. Um, you know, no matter the outcome. But uh, definitely it was a great weekend. We split one and one. Um, you know, a lot of things to learn from, from the win and from the loss. So we kind of went over a couple things in practice today and just looking to grow throughout the week. And then, you know, individually, just looking to get more and more acclimated as the days go on and then bring what I can to the teams to help us win on Friday and then moving forward. Of course, of course, as well, despite being a little time, how, how has it been working with the likes of uh, Rob, Pablo and the and the rest of the coaches here so far? Oh, it's been really good. I mean, this is, you know, my first, uh, you know, real professional yep. experience. So it's just, I'm just trying to soak it all in. So. And how have you been getting on with the team so far? What, what are you making of the team cohesion, of course? Oh, the guys yeah. are great. I mean, I think that as soon as you come into a situation, you can, you can tell right away yeah. whether guys like playing with each other or not. And this is a group of guys, no question, that everybody likes playing with each other. So um, I think from the record of the team, you can tell that. Mm. But then I think if you watch a practice or you watch a game, if we were all mic'd up, I think you would be able to hear that everybody on the team is very cohesive. Finally, do you have any personal aspirations for the rest of the season? Of course, it's a, it's a short amount of time till the end of the season. Are you looking to, to just make your mark and uh, yeah, go, go from there? Yeah, pretty much, um, you know, personal aspirations just get better every day. Just, mm. you know, bring something new to the team every day that, you know, help us get another win. I think that, you know, most important thing is just winning and advancing. So whatever I can do to, you know, bring to the team to help us just get better every day. Thank you very much for your time and welcome to the Leicester Riders. Thank you. Thank you very much.